Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Car Mechanic Simulator. Uh, it's been a while since we've recorded a video on this, but as of today, which was probably yesterday when this video goes live, the DLCs got released. So we have four DLCs. We've got Paganis, we've got Maseratis, we've got Dodges, we've got all sorts. So um, I asked you guys what... Um, DLC you wanted to see first, and the first one came out by storm over 50% of the votes out of four options was the Ford DLC. So uh, what we're going to do, we're going to, I think what we're going to do, we'll do the Mustang. So this is the Ford Mustang Mark 1 from 1971, I think. Oh, this looks nice in here. <laughs> so we have a lot of stuff to do. We're going to do a complete disassemble of this car and that car. Uh, the next... The other two cars in the DLC, which is the 350 Raptor and also the Mustang. They're both 2017. And it was really difficult to actually find damaged versions. So what we're going to do, we're going to do um, upgrades of them. We're also going to upgrade both of these because... Mustangs were supposed to be upgraded. Um, but yeah. Let's move this to the first lifter. And start removing the parts. Oh, we got a front bumper to come off. We got some headlights. License plates. You guys know the drill by now. Yeah. Woo! Ow! <laughs> that hurt. <laughs> uh, we got a right tail light and all our license plates and that. Uh, oh, okay, we got little windows there as well. Um, okay, I think that's everything off of the car. Uh, how is it? Interior disassemble. There we go. There we go. Right. Now what we need to do is... Oh, the game's frozen. We need to pull out all of our cooling. And our brake stuff. Where's the brake servo? This is quite a nice looking engine. I'm not going to lie. Um, right, let's lift the car up. Uh, so what we need to do first is we need to remove the gearbox. And then we can use the engine crane to actually lift it. There we go. Uh, that is that removed. I think it should be ready to come out now. Yes. All right, the engine is out. Uh, now what we need to do is remove all of these parts. Those are some nice rims. The 
I like how a lot of the parts in this game are the same as the stock cars. They're not just, oh, every single part needs to be realistic. Obviously, engines have to be a bit different. But the rest of it, all these running stuff, the suspension and stuff like that, perfectly fine. The running gear. Uh, rubber bushings. Is that all four out? Oh yeah, it is. What am I doing? Uh, ventilated brake discs, uh, hub bearings. Ah, what is wrong with that? Did I forget the tie rod? Yep, yeah, I'm always forgetting stuff in this game. Why is it a thing? Right, there's the middle muffler. Why is my Google Home in front of my TV? I cannot see anything. Surprisingly, we got drum brakes in the rear. Hmm. Okay. Drum wheel, and the wheel hub comes out. The one part I wish the game could sort out is all of the rubber bushings. Because they sorted out half of them, but they haven't sorted out all of them yet. There we go. And that's the knuckle housing. And all we've got left is the fuel tank to remove. There we go. Complete disassemble of the... Shut up, laptop. That is the uh, complete disassemble of the Ford Mark 1 Mustang. Uh, now... Uh, if I just come over here. 
Oh, something failed to repair. There we go. Right, first of all, what we need to do, we need to work out exactly what engine we are using. So we have a VAOHV385 by the looks of it. So we need to uh, create that. Oh, we got V10. I wonder what that's from. Dodge Viper. Oh, nice. I thought the Dodge Viper had a V8. V8 twin turbo. Mm. Does a V8 suit that, though? Uh, we got some... I don't know what car that's from. That's the engine we need to go for. Uh, let's take a look at these. That's the Pagani engine. Whoa, there are loads of engines now. W12 twin turbo is going to be the Bentley Continental. So, I am looking forward to building that engine. That's going to look real sick. So, this has 370 horsepower, which is nice. Um, so, first of all, what we need is a OHVI engine block. A lot of these are going to be V8. Uh, so if I search up... Oh yeah, now I have a capture card. You guys can actually see this search box. So it doesn't look like I'm just doing stuff. Um, so we are looking for V8 OHV engine block. OHV I. There we go, Ford. I feel like just buying one of every single four part. Uh, exhaust manifold, OHVI. Uh, OHVI, 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 uh, wait, intake manifold B, what's that for? Uh, okay, we'll do that for now. So we need V8 OHV camshafts. Uh, typical stuff. Air trumpet. the hell is that? Uh, I forgot the crankshaft and the camshaft. Uh, V8OHV and camshaft.
Uh, V8 OHV cam gear. There we go. And we also need a ignition distributor. But I am going to go to the performance shop and buy myself... Perf Have we got all the performance parts for... I think we do. They got OHVI on there. Fares, fares. Um... OHVI, yes. Um, ignition distributor, that was it. I don't know which one we need it for, so I'm just getting everything. And all the V8s. Why not? Uh, so we need a timing belt. Ah, clip bees. Don't forget about them. Uh, oh yeah, I need to go here. Um, clip. Clip B. Uh, we also need timing belt as well. So if we search up V8, we should find some timing belts towards the bottom. I think it's a OHV one. Yes. Okay. So we got the timing cover as well. Um... Hang on, water pump. Crankshaft pulley, that was what I went on for. There we go. Um, uh, we need an I6B alternator. Why do we need that? V8 OHV crankshaft pulley. Uh, what pistons are we looking for? Just normal piston with comrades. Um, right. There's so much stuff this lags now. Uh, there's the pistons. There we go. Eight of them.
There we go. Ah, oh, have we seriously got to put each one of those rods in? Oh dear. I don't like putting individual rods in. I can't get the pistons. There we go. Right, now what I want to do is rotate. Um, right, where's the... Rod caps. What else do we need? Um... Crank... Crankshaft caps. That's it. Here we go. Rod caps. Rod cap. Rod cap. Rod cap. I'm going to keep doing that. It's going to get annoying. Rod cap. Rod cap. Don't worry, this is only two more. Rod cap. And the final rod cap. And there we go, we're all bolted in, and we can put our oil pan on, and we should be ready to go. Right, um, let's rotate this back round and sort out the rest of the engine. And that's that bolted on. Are you kidding me? They're OHVJs. Okay, so we need an I6B alternator. Uh, what's that? OHVIs. Actually, I might need those belts V8 see when the menu's like this it doesn't lag but as soon as you get the whole thing on it doesn't work uh, serpentine belt Uh, what's this? Power steering pump. Oh, we've already got the radiator fan, which is nice. So we need an ink... Ignition coil and a fuel filter. Uh, carburetor.
carburetor four barrel. Actually, I'll get that on the other one, and also the ignition coil B, and the fuel filter. Why not? Uh, ignition coil B, fuel filter. Get a fuel pump for next episode. There was something else. Carburetor. The one thing that was right in the middle of my screen. Oh, shiny. Valve push rod. Okay. And that's not on this one, is it? V, 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 V for Valve. Where are you? That should be plenty. Oh, and we've got rocker arms on these as well. I hate building V8s. They're just a little bit annoying. There we go. Rocker arm number two. Okay. I think I changed my mind. I want valve push rods to be fixed. Here we go. Rocker arms. Nice, right, that's... Wait, what? Uh, why OHVJs? Engine... Head cover? I can't find him.
Right, there's the exhaust manifold going in. Uh, let's do this. I will find the engine covers later. I think it might be a bug with my game. So I will try to find them in a second. I forgot spark plugs. Here we go, rock arm. Another OHVJ. Right, I'm going to have to go find those parts. But uh, this video has gone on for quite a while. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please leave a like. Comment down below and subscribe. And I shall see you next time. Goodbye.